Welcome to Odoo Tutorial by Asamant Patel. Today we will see how to configure the planning module in Odoo 15. So by opening the module, you can view the schedules of the employees in the calendar form. So by selecting this, we can view these schedules of the employees. We can view the schedules according to the day, week, month and year. Copy previous is used to copy the previous schedule of the calendar and here we have the option to publish the schedules of the employees and here we have the plan order option too. Apart from this, you can view the window according to the gun view, calendar view, this view and in the confirm view and here we have the filtering option too. Let's go to the configuration settings. So here we have the option to enable the allow and assignment in the planning module. So we can enable this to let the employees unassign themselves and then save it. Moving on to the resources, the resources can be selected while creating new schedules. So it helps the employees to understand the resources in which he will be working up during his assigned schedule. You can create new resources from here. Then moving on to the roles, for that configuration roles, the work of the employee can be assigned to the employees according to their assigned roles. You can create a new role from here. Moving on to the shift template, go to configuration shift template. Here you can see the shift time, role, project and task. Let's create a new shift template as shown here. Developer, you can add the task and the time, shifting time and save it. And you can see the save shift template in the list. Going back to the dashboard, you can schedule the results of the employees by choosing the add icon option here. Click on the create icon and you can select the shift of the schedule as shown here. You can select the sale order item and also you can enable the repeat option too and save it as a template then click save button. You can also publish and send. In the same way, you can create and add schedules by role, project and sale order. Now, let's move on to my planning. So, the employee can view the schedules all from this window. Here, the schedule is displayed along with their details. So, an employee will receive the proper information of the published schedules. And also, we can ensure that none of the workings are overlapping. So, at the bottom, you can view the total number of shifts. You have on each day and here you can see the open shift. If any cases, if these employees fail to complete, complete their work, they can jump into the shift and finish the activity. So such shifts are called open shift. Now let's move on to the reporting section. Here we have the planning analysis. So the report based on hours per resource is displayed here. Here you can see the total allocated hours of every employee and the hours of each of them in different months. Here you can add different measures like allocated hours, then time and percentage, effective hours, etc. Thus, this is how the planning module in Node 15 works. Thank you.